Introduction John was at a shopping mall. Today at school he had learnt about various shapes. He looked around and saw various shapes in the objects around him. Let us look what he saw. He saw a rectangle billboard, a circle logo and a rectangle window. Come, let's learn more about shape. Objectives At the end of this lesson you'll be able to Identify geometrical shapes Creating shapes by paper folding and paper cutting Solve tangram puzzle Create tessellation pattern Geometrical shapes Hello friends Geometry is the study of lines, curves and shapes There can be many different shapes Circle, triangle, square, rectangle, sphere and cube are a few to name. If you look closely, you will see a variety of geometrical shapes around you. Look at the window of your room. It is rectangular in shape. The design on the tiles is triangle. Look at the ball lying in the room. Its shape is spherical. Now look at the frames of the painting hanging on the wall. It is square in shape. Now you have seen and learnt different objects with different shapes. Creating shapes by folding and cutting paper. Anu is busy cutting paper. She has cut paper in different shapes. Let us have a closer look at it. Anu takes a sheet of paper. What you can say about the shape of this sheet? Yes. It is rectangular in shape. Anu tries to make triangle out of it. Draw a dotted line on this sheet of paper like this. Cut the paper on the dotted line. Now what you see is a triangle. Friends, let's try to make a circle by a plain square sheet. Make a line on this square like this. Fold it on the line such that upper triangle is superimposed on the lower triangle. After folding, we get the shape like this. Again, draw a line on it like this. Again, fold it on the line. Now you will get a smaller triangle than the previous one. Draw a curve line on it and cut it on the curve line. It is divided into two parts. Finally, open two folded parts. Look at it. It's wonderful to see two pictures, one of which is circle. Activity It's Anu's craft assignment and she wants to make a paper hat. Let's learn along with her to make a hat. For this, we take a plain sheet of paper. First, fold down the upper half of the sheet from the red line. Then, unfold it. Now, what you see is a line in the middle of the paper, right? Next, we fold both upper triangles on the red lines as shown. Check. It must look as shown to you. Now, at the bottom, fold the top strip upward on the red line. After this, fold the two triangles on the left and on the right backwards to make them disappear. It must look like this. Finally, turn the paper over and fold the other lower strip upwards. You have formed the well-known hat. Geometry Facts The geometry facts are generally declaring the three parts. Those parts are one-dimensional, two-dimensional and three-dimensional. The one-dimensional geometry facts is called the line. The lines have only length. The two-dimensional geometry facts is about length and breadth. The three-dimensional geometry facts is about length, breadth and height. Geometry Vocabulary Let us know about some basic terms used in geometry. Point It is an imaginary thought. Lines All these are straight lines. Line segment Part of a line is called a line segment. Here AB is a line segment. These are the curved lines. Measuring line segment. It's time that we learn to measure a line segment. 
To measure the line segment AB, we use a centimeter scale. Put one end of scale starting with zero just below the point A. On going from point A to B, digits 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 are travelled. Therefore, length of the line segment is 5 cm. 2D and 3D shapes. Now let us talk about two-dimensional or 2D shapes. Some 2D shapes are circle, triangle, square and rectangle. Some three-dimensional or 3D shapes are cube, cone, cylinder and sphere. Plane and curved surfaces. Look at these two objects, blackboard and an apple. Blackboard's plane surfaces are its surfaces which have length and breadth. When you touch the surface of an apple, its surface is not straight. This is curved surface. A polygon is a plane figure made of three or more sides. Various types of polygons are triangle, square, rectangle, pentagon. Now we'll study about plane figure, sides and vertices. Look at this square. Arrows 1, 2, 3, 4 indicate the sides of a square. A square has four sides. The point at which two sides meet is called a vertex. Arrows 6, 7, 8, 9 indicates the vertices of a square. So here we see square has four vertices. Similarly, triangle has three sides and three vertices. Rectangle has four sides and four vertices. Tangram Tangram is an old Chinese puzzle. From the pieces of the tangram, we can make shapes of animals, people and things. This is a five pieces tangram. Five pieces of tangram are Hey kids, it's time to have some fun. Using pieces of tangram, try to make the picture given below. Tessellation Tessellation is a collection of shapes that cover the surface of a plane, leaving no gaps or overlaps. It can also be called tiling. Self-assessment. Drag and drop the correct option to its respective box. Summary. Let us summarize what you have learned. Geometry is the study of lines, curves and shapes. Different shapes are circle, triangle, square, rectangle, sphere and cube. A polygon is a plane figure made of three or more sides. Triangle has three sides and three vertices. Square and rectangle has four sides and four vertices. Tangram is an old Chinese puzzle. Tessellation is a collection of shapes that cover the surface of a plane, leaving no gaps or overlaps.